That's a total of 35,000. You're not to have any unsupervised contact with your children. Do they live with you full time? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Dude, what are you thinking, man? So he's getting he's on bail, like they got a thirty-five thousand dollar bail. He's gonna get out, yeah. And actually, he's only gonna pay ten percent of that to get out. Yeah. Well, the bondsman, right? I guess covers it, but how do you know so much about this, huh? What? <laughs> anyway, what? Uh, <laughs> uh, it's jail for dummy books. <laughs> Audio books are my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back. I'm Simitoskin. This is Buff Pro, and we are on to catch a predator again. Heck yeah. Catch we them got, all. We're going to catch them. we got to catch them all. <laughs> <laughs> Our recurring series of why don't you take a seat? Have a seat. But as the decoy walks behind the curtain, oh, she's already getting them with that have a seat. Yeah. Have a seat. Hey, have a seat. Have a seat. Just take a seat over there. You know, these, these dudes are doing. Mm, just some terrible things, and there's a special place in hell for all of them. Yep. Well, if this is your first or your fifth video, subscribe. I'm trying to get to 10 million subs. You guys have been freaking still doing amazing. It's so much, so many new people coming in. Heck yeah. I'll leave a comment. Tell us how what you like and what you don't like. All that cool stuff. We're like, we, we need your opinions on what what things to react to and what more videos to make. Your opinion does matter a lot. You can check out Buff Pro on YouTube and Twitch. At Buff Pro. And let's let's get to it. Apparently, we've been talking about nobody ever runs when we do these. This dude's running. Ah, uh, yeah. That's what Mary told me. He said this dude's running. It was a to catch a predator first. This man made plans online for a threesome with an underage teen and his adult girlfriend. Oh, 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 oh. wow. Oh. I wonder if his girlfriend, his adult girlfriend, knows about that, or if, or if mm. nah. Now, who is this in the towel right here? <laughs> is this the is this the stand-in? He's showing up, you know, and they're like, "Hey!" Oh, you know, they they setting the whole scene was up. Is that the girlfriend? Yeah, I don't know. Said he and his girlfriend wanted to have sex with a girl who told them she was a fifteen-year-old virgin. Come on in. Oh, well, where's it? Where's his girlfriend at? He just you know, if his girlfriend's involved, where's she at? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe she's. In the car? <laughs> I don't know. You know, but he's, he's going know. to meet her up for What? Is this a clothes basket just sitting here by the door? Yeah. <laughs> if he notices that, it's going to be his first clue that something's off. Like, Wait a minute. What? What is that? Oh, this is gross, man. Yeah, they're all gross. Online, he calls himself Southwest Georgia Male Yes. Southwest Georgia Male Yes. I thought that was like a different, like, swag male. Yes. Swag, swag mailies or something, you know? <laughs> Swag Malius. I like how they always like share their their names that they use online because it's I, don't know, I feel like you can tell a lot about a guy. Yeah. About his about his name. And this dude is <laughs> I wish it was swag. Yeah. <laughs> Southwest Georgia male, yes. You didn't have to ask. Yes, I am a male. <laughs> uh, his chat is one of the most graphic and disturbing we've come across. At first he offers the decoy, Aaron Lynn B, two hundred and fifty dollars. He's like, yo, guy, I got some money, you know. What, what's up? I got a little bit of money. What do you say about that decoy? Why do you want to give me money? He says, because I want you. Hmm. <laughs> what do they say about millennials? They always end their sentences in lol. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> why, why do you want to give me money, lol? Then he tells her about another girl he met online. She was 15 like you. Her mom was at work. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. Uh, wait, why are you tell me this so that they thought it was cool? So I'm supposed to think it's cool. All right. Yeah. Kay. Oh. Her and her friend. And then he describes in detail how he claims to have taken one of the girl's virginity. Wow. This guy. He's just, he's just like, let me tell you. Let me tell you all about it. Let me tell you how I did it. Let me tell you how creepy I am. You know. Uh, what is wrong with these people that they would even think that talking about this to someone else would make them be like. Oh yeah. Yeah, right. Wow, that's great. Tell me more. Like, Jeez. Like, what, what kind of kind of idiot do you gotta be? Gross. Obviously not a self-aware idiot, that's for sure. <laughs> Get got, fool! Then introduces the decoy to a woman who calls herself Phyllis, his girlfriend, and says she wants to be there with us. So the dude's over here snapping pics and he's like, Hey yo, Phyllis, guess what? Got another one. And she's like, Oh yeah, let me get in on that yeah, one. I'll come this time. Disgusting! It's gross! I can't. Can't even. I can't. I can't believe the sick freak freaking got away with it once. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. And and then that he's even with someone that's like 
about it, you know? Yeah, gross. Phyllis then apparently gets on the computer herself and starts chatting with Aaron Lynn B and explains how it would work. You, you think you think this this girlfriend even exists? Or if he's just like, yeah, let me let my girlfriend talk to you. And he's like, yeah, still me. But he's just like <laughs> trying to. Yeah, maybe. What, yeah. Did the, what did the decoy even say to them to, like, to get this going? Just like, hey, why are you sending me money? Lol. K.O. And he's like. Yeah, so you're down right there. Yeah, oh yeah you're right there. Oh, my God. This is going to be so great. Uh. Oh, man. Phyllis, the girlfriend, doesn't show up. She apparently had to work. But. <laughs> She had to work, but she is real. But she's sending her boyfriend to do the job for her. Oh my god! The decoy here, just like imagine being this person, like, like okay, yeah, come on in, like just run to the back room, like holy crap, get me away from this person. Yeah. But Southwest Georgia male, yes, does, and is now in our house and in hot pursuit of our decoy. Okay, she's like, whoop, whoop, let me get out of here. Let me get away from this creep. Oh my god! Staring at me. For refrigerator is that? What is this? Dang. Is that the refrigerator? That's pretty cool. Yeah, hey, that's old school right there. Is Can't it? You get no cup of water out of that. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> no ice maker on that thing. Dang. You have to put the put the ice in the little cube thing, and you know, get in there and oh, like, yeah, let it sit yeah, and yeah. Like, crack it. You get like you know two or three glasses <laughs> of ice, and just like gotta put more back in there. Yeah, and then for when you want those those sweet snacks. You know what I'm saying? You put your Kool Aid in there. Yeah. And the popsicle sticks. Oh, the one thing about Woo! those though is like you got that friend that aren't he don't really you know they, they're a little new school. They got the ice maker. They don't really know what it's about, so they get a couple pieces out. And they put water in there to replace what they took out. <laughs> so then you get it out to get some, and you're like, oh, ice. And you just spill water over yourself. You're like, why? Hey, come on, man. Why did you do this? Whole tray or nothing. <laughs> exactly. Jeez. All right, you a chance to get a hug? Have a seat. But as the decoy walks behind the curtain. The oh, she's already getting him with a have a seat. Yeah. Have a seat. Hey, have a seat. Have a seat. Come in. I don't even get a hug. Where you at, girl? Come on. Chris Hansen. Jump, jump out there. Jump scare him. I mean, he's late. Jump scare him. Behind the curtain, the man sees our camera crew <laughs> and runs. <laughs> oh. oh! Chris hasn't even get a chance. He's like, hey, yo, girl. Oh. Oh, oh. Oh. Yo, I'm out of here. All right. Well, Mary said this is a dude that ran. Okay. How far do you think he makes it? I hope he makes it right to the concrete <laughs> so he falls on it when they tase him. <laughs> I, I hope he smashes concrete. <laughs> Okay, all right. And he keeps on running, even after sheriff's deputies order him to stop. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Officers he's like, he's like, not, nah, uh, 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 not today, bro. Uh, he's like, kind of looking over the shoulder, like, ah, <laughs> can I get away from here? Yeah, oh. He's still looking at that dude, like, dang, he fast. <laughs> that man caught him so quick. An officer's teaser knocks him to the ground. <laughs> oh. <laughs> After he's arrested, he, oh, takes... he even he even kind of stopped though. He's like, "All right, all right, zap, <laughs> dude." That thing sounded painful. We can tase him anyway. Man with the incredibly vulgar chat reveals something that, ironically, no longer surprises us. I was a man to send the shirt. Oh, oh no! no! Oh, what? No! The battle shirt. I want to go to prison. Crying about it, dude. Yeah, you don't want to go to prison. You going? Yeah, you going? You going? You going? Huh? What loser they think I got? Do what? What loser they think I have, Mr. Gary? Yeah, Mr. Gary's like, okay. Yeah, hey, should have thought about that before yeah. you uh, start sleeping with uh, little kids. Yeah, tell, well, he says he's, he's got a wife, so he only have a girlfriend. Well, who they call? Uh, whoever it was was real. They said they got, he's got a side chick. He's cheating on his wife. Oh, and he's in there. I'm about to lose everything I got. Mr. Gary, feel sorry for Please me. Please feel bad for me. Like, nah, Mr. Gary's like, bro. <laughs> no, no, dude. Nah, you done. Sorry. You done for. You you done messed up. The 35-year-old asks to speak to a lawyer, and the interview is over. He's then taken to the county jail. Finger. I said, hey, hey, hey. You, you guys aren't going to let me go. I need, I need to talk to a lawyer. Okay, well, you're going to... Put you in jail until, you know, your lawyer gets here and then <laughs> they do all that. We're going to go ahead and process you because we caught you red-handed, dude, so you ain't going nowhere. That's a total of 35000 You're not to have any unsupervised contact with your children. Do they live with you full-time? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Oh, he's got kids, oh, too. He just lost his kids, too. Dude, what are you thinking, man? So getting his own bail, like they got a $35,000 bail. 
is going to get out. Yeah, and actually, he's only going to pay ten percent of that to get out. Yeah, well, the bondsman right. I guess covers it, but how do you know so much about this? Huh? huh? What? <laughs> anyway, what? Uh, <laughs> uh, it's jail for dummy books. <laughs> Audio books are my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Marvin Harrison Smith was sentenced to 13 years behind bars and 12 years on probation. He is still on the RSO list. So he did go to he did go to jail. Okay. okay. He was released until uh, until the trial, right? I, I don't know. I don't know. How, I, yeah, I guess because that's what happened to the other dude, right? He was, yeah. I don't. I don't know how it all works. Like I said, he, no more. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you know, you're innocent until proven guilty at your trial, and yeah. then, then you're done. Then you're done. Every time a kitty dealer gets tased, the angel gets his way. <laughs> you only got tased one time. Yes, That's a little, I mean. Just hoping for more? I hope all of these guys get it. You know what I mean? Oh, like, yeah. I, and like, the fact that it got away with it before, really pisses me off. If this had been any other situation where like the man like stopped and then they tased him, they'd be like, oh my God, you know, shaming the police. But since <laughs> right. it's in this situation, it's like, haze him again. Get him again. Get him ah! again. Like, hey, ain't nobody looking. One more time. <laughs> Don't play on kids. Chris Hansen didn't get a chance to. He didn't to even get to talk to him. No, he didn't. Dude just saw the cameras and was like, no. I'm out. I'm like, Whoa. <laughs> I didn't bring that camera. I'm out of here. I'm glad we actually got to see somebody run, you know. Cause nobody's nobody there. Everybody always just gets caught and like goes down. Like, oh, he, he he ran for a little bit. I was gonna say he didn't like hightail it yeah, either. Like, yeah. He didn't even like he was not look like, back. Uh, he was just like, oh no. god. <laughs> yeah, he prepped for it when he saw the dude over his shoulder. He's like, I am not getting away from that guy. <laughs> and we got a we have a uh, we have a a link in the description where you guys can click on that and you can link us videos that you want to see us react to. So if you want to see more of the Catch a Predator, you got some some ones that are that are that are good to react to. You can recommend them there. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. That's it. That was a yeah. short and sweet. It was. It was. Yeah, I got him. You got got. I hope they went and got Phyllis too. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, go go find her at work. Freaking find whoever that is and get her while you're at it. Uh, but man, if today's your birthday, happy birthday. Say toast to my friends, and I love you. Flames.